this looks promising. Yes, definitely early Akaviri stonework here. We've got to get this bridge down. These pillars must have something to do with it. Yes, these are Akaviri symbols. Here, let's see. You have the symbol for king and warrior, and of course the symbol for dragonborn. That's the one that appears to have a sort of arrow shape pointing downward. Yes, that's it. The symbol on the pillar on the left. Whatever you did, it worked. Let's see what those old blades are. Why are you stopping? We should be careful here. See these symbols on the floor? Hmm. Esbern's right. Look like pressure plates. We'll cross once it's safe. Be careful. Another of the lost the Kaviri arts. No doubt it's triggered by, well, blood. Your blood, Dragonborn. Look here. You see how the ancient blades revered Reman Cyrodiil? This whole place appears to be a shrine to Reman. He ended the Kaviri invasion under mysterious circumstances. Fascinating. Original Akaviri bas-reliefs, almost entirely intact.
Amazing. You can see how the Akaviri craftsmen were beginning to embrace the more flowing Nordic style. We're here for Alduin's wall, right, Esbern? Uh, yes, of course. We'll have more time to look around later, I suppose. Let's see what's up ahead. Second era Kabir sculpture in my Hesburn, we need information, not a lecture on artists. Yes, yes, let's see what we have. Look, here is your friend. This panel goes back to the beginning of time, when Alduin and the Dragon Cult ruled over Skyrim. Here, the humans rebelled against their Dragon Lord Lord, the legendary Kraken. Alduin's defeat is the centerpiece of the war. You see, here is falling from the sky. The Nord Tongs, masters of the voice, are arrayed against him. So does it show how they defeated him? Isn't that why we're here? Ah, patience, my dear. The Akaviri were not a straightforward people. Everything is couched in hell, mythic symbol. Yes, yes. This here, coming from the mouths of the Nord heroes, this is the Akaviri symbol for shout. But there's no way to know what shout is meant. You mean they used a shout to defeat Alduin? You're sure? Hmm? Oh, yes. Presumably something rather specific. Or even Alduin himself. Remember, this is where they recorded all the news of Alduin and the third. So we're looking for a shout then. Damn it. Have you ever heard of such a thing? A shout that can knock a dragon out of the sky? I was afraid you were going to say that. I guess there's nothing for it. We'll have to ask the Greybeards for help. I hope to avoid involving them in this, but we have no other choice. If they had their way, you do nothing but sit up on their mountain with them and talk to the sky or whatever it is they do. The Greybeards are so afraid of power that they won't use it. Think about it. Have they tried to stop the Civil War or done anything?